Hello again, it's me, Mava Martin, and um, I'd like to continue my uh, tutorial for theme making. And I've been getting a lot of requests lately, and um, most of you want to know how gradients work. Gradients and radio buttons and a text box. <clears throat> well, the easiest thing, uh, radio buttons are not that easy. Text boxes are not very easy either, but gradients are, so I'm going to explain uh, the gradients first. So I'm going to show it on the button, so you need to follow my previous uh, tutorials first. So um, I would like to draw, instead of just a flat color, I want a gradient. So we'll need um, your button top color and you will need a button button color and I'm going to make it gray like this now of course you will need button color top uh, button color bottom and here top then copy this again like this. Um, well, basically a gradient is instead of a solid brush you have a linear gradient brush so we're going to define LGB as new linear gradient brush. Uh, it asks for a rectangle now so uh, we'll just fill this rectangle. Okay, then the first color. Um, the first color will be our top color our second color will be the bottom color and then the angle for um, gradient I usually pick 90 and F because it's sing it's a single uh, numeric thing I suck at explaining sorry and then we'll just build our project and oh wait I didn't fill it so instead of filling uh, now it's just filled with our button color top so now we just do g dot fill rectangle and our brush will be our linear gradient brush so LGB then again this rectangle like this and now if we build it this is the result of course it's ugly but um, yeah just yeah, just figure it out for yourself what looks nice and what not. As for the um, radio buttons, the easiest thing for controls you don't know if you don't know how to make them, just um, open my ghost theme or uh, any other theme you can find on hack forms and just look at the source. Uh, it gives you great hints on uh, on how to make them. So I'll open the class for my ghost theme and where is it um, ghost theme and here we can see where is the um, radio button and then you can just copy the whole class that's um, okay and this one doesn't use the color hook so maybe I should uh, immediately use the color hook so again you do dim um, well, obviously it needs text, it needs a little circle, and yeah, that's about it. So first we'll do dim text color as a brush, because text is a brush, and dim circle color as pen, because, well, you draw... Um, circles with pins. So, um, text color equals get brush um, text and circle is get pen circle. Alright. Now, um, obviously the paint hook is wrong 
because it doesn't use a color hook. So we clear our um, radio button with our back color and now we want uh, wait um, so here we have a property checked so yeah if it's checked it's true and if it's not checked it's false and that's going to determine whether we're going to draw a filled circle or a non-filled circle so uh, I'll do if um, if checked with the one with the underscore there if checked then and else oh, like this okay so if it's checked we need to do g dot uh, ellipse our circle pen and then a new rectangle uh, 0 0 and I want it to be 16 16 like this and if it's checked so now we have to fill it as well fill ellipse circle color no um it's a brush so new solid brush I'll just fill it with black here you can make a new color in the color hook for the filling of it and then a new rectangle well obviously the inner circle needs to be smaller so I think something like three um, four four five five or something it, it just you need to fiddle around with it a bit so and if it's not checked we just draw it like this and then you want to draw your text text font text color new point um we're going to put it at 22 2 or something okay let's check it out oh um i forgot to change this to um demo and this is going to cause some errors because what this does if you click a radio button it's going to uncheck all the others so obviously that would be a demo radio button and not a ghost radio button because that doesn't exist anymore so we build it and let's see if it works um, demo radio Oh. Uh, this is what happens if you do something wrong with your color hook and it will look like this so we did something wrong oh obviously we didn't set the colors in the sub new sorry for that um, so set color text black set color circle black as well sorry and now if we build it it should work and yes it does as you can see the circle looks a bit um, a bit it's very ugly because it's a very sharp so we need to smooth it out so you said g dot smoothing mode to high quality or anti alias uh, it doesn't really matter like this and now the edges will look softer and I'm going to look if the checked. Okay, that circle is obviously wrong. So we need to make it bigger. Something about like this. And that's better. So I'll, I'll copy this. And now we have a working radio button. And the same thing is for other. Um, controls. If you don't know how they work um, or how to make them, just um, just look at other themes, and they'll yeah, it's very just look at them and see how they fix that. So here we have our uh, basic form. So thanks for watching. If anything's not clear, just uh, post in the thread, and I'll try to help you out. Bye.